Okay, so today's video is my new attempt up Alp de Zwift. On the back of my last video, first time climbing then top, at the end of that video, I asked, is there any appetite for me climbing Alp de Zwift again? I'm over the moon with this result, so much so that I wanna go back to the Alp de Zwift after doing then top and see if I can push hard up the Alp in the same way that I did up then top with the same rocking technique. I wanna see if I can shave any more time off my PR. Now, if that's a video you'd like me to make, please let me know. I'd be interested to see if there's any interest in watching me do the Alp again. And I got loads of responses from you guys. You guys that are watching my videos, I got loads of responses in the comments about people wanting to see me go max effort at Alp to Zwift. So that's what today is. Strategy, I've got no strategy other than max effort. So from the moment I hit the banner at the bottom of the Alp, I'm gonna go max effort at, up to the top. When I say max effort, I don't mean sprint, because obviously I'm gonna burn out after 400 meters, but I'm gonna push as hard as I can to the top and see how far I get hopefully the top, and beat my PR. So my existing PR up out to Zwift is a very good question. Hang on, let me check. So today's challenge is I'm going to climb out to Zwift. I've done it twice now in a PB attempt, and I've also done it three times on top of that, so five in total, of which twice I had to call it because it was part of my four horseman attempt. It will be the fourth or fifth time of actually completing it. <sighs> Ninety-two, twenty-one. That's a good Sunday workout. An hour and forty-four minutes. Okay, so I've just checked it by rewatching my video that I made um, in when did I make it? So yeah, two months ago was my last time I climbed out to Zwift just during Christmas, and I did it in ninety-two minutes and twenty-one seconds. So I'm going to try and get it in under. 90 minutes, that's today's plan. I actually have some really good news. So today, I weighed myself. I need to update it on the system. I weighed myself and I've lost weight. Uh, not surprisingly, because I've done loads of racing. Um, but I'm gonna log in now and just update my settings. Previously, my last weigh-in was ages ago um, and I haven't changed it since. I have lost some weight, so I now weigh I don't know if you can see that. So I now weigh 101.4 kg. The reason why I haven't changed it, cut a long story short, I weigh myself in my local gym, someone broke it, and I don't own scales at home. I finally pulled my finger out and bought myself some scales, and I've weighed myself. I now weigh 97.8 kg. So I've lost, how much have I lost? 98, 97.8. So I've lost over three kg, which is fantastic. So that's really gonna help. So I'm just gonna update it now, 97.8. I'm over the moon, and if I'm honest with you, because of that weigh-in is the reason I'm actually attempting out the Zwift. I was gonna leave this until next week or the week after, but I've not ridden the bike for three days, so I'm well rested. I've lost weight because my scales were delivered this morning and I weighed myself 20 minutes ago. Uh, and I'm gonna do it. I feel really motivated for this, 97.8 kg. I can't believe I'm below 100 kg, considering five years ago now, I weighed 190 kg. Uh, mental. Anyway, I'm gonna attempt this, so let's do this. Okay, so really boringly, I've started the road to Sky Route, which is about 7k leading to the bottom of the Alp. So I've got to do 7k, burn energy. I don't want to be burning, but yeah, I'm gonna get there. At least my legs will be warm. I've done no calculations, which I probably now, on hindsight, as I'm saying it, should have worked out what my corners were already. But hopefully, because it was only two months ago, my 90 day PR ghost should be there. So I get to beat my ghost. So this video, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Rather than count down my corners, I'm gonna race my ghost up out to Zwift. So yeah, so max effort. I'm gonna put the same energy into this that I put into Ventop. If I use the same energy on this ride as I used on Ventop, I will absolutely smash this attempt. Let me turn the fan off for a second. Right, we've just crossed the green banner. So I'm gonna get some pace up. So I'm gonna get to the first corner at max effort, and then I can do the whole push, recover, push, recover tactic that I did on Ventop. So I've got the mountain bike, not the mountain bike, the climbing bike. Frame is Trekamonda, wheels 
lightweight minim stein. So I haven't changed it for my Ventop attempt. I think I did Ventop three days ago. So I've had three days off the bike. Here we go, here's the banner. So I've got the light bike and wheels, Minenstein wheels. Here we go. Okay, I don't have a ghost, annoyingly. So I don't have a 90 day PR. So that tactic has gone out the window. Push, right. Okay, right, first corner, first corner, 21. I averaged 290 watts to that first corner. That's gonna be my best, I think. Right, I now need my heart rate to come down, okay. Corner 20. I averaged 215 watts for corner 20. We're now pushing corner 19. 12%. Okay, corner 19. Push. I'm grinding. Oh, we've got 18. I was distracted. Miles away. Got my gears wrong there. Heart rate's really high. So that was 204 watts for 18. So my watts are dropping big time. Corner 17 at 237 watts. <clears throat> if anyone questions, max effort. 180 is sprinting. 170 to 175 is max effort. Oh my God. Come on. Come on, right. I'm going to burn out of this pace. I've pushed this really hard. I'm going to focus on my gears, my heart rate, and my cadence, and prioritize them above camera now. So, excuse me for a couple of corners. I'll be back shortly. So that last corner, I dropped it to 195. Um, yeah, heart rate is killing me. Uh, this is max effort. Uh, grinding, come on Ryan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Corner 13 in just under 30 minutes. Averaged 212 watts on that corner. Okay, that's corner 11 coming up to. Uh, yeah, averaging about what, 211? Uh, 
I'm really starting to grind now. I'm trying my best to keep my cadence up. I'm burning out. Heart rate, heart rate's been too high for too long. I've got no 90 day PR, which is annoying because I have no idea how well I'm doing. I absolutely smashed the first half. My seat has started clicking, it needs tightening. For the first time, I think this corner is gonna be under 200 watts. Breathe right. Okay, that's by far my worst corner, corner eight. Let's get to seven. I'm grinding, grinding. Okay, okay, that's corner seven. And now we've got the long, drawn out from seven to six. Right, fan off. Okay, I'm coming up to an hour. So that's one hour to get to corner six. I'm massively ahead of schedule. Four, three, two, one. That's one hour, one hour. So that sub one hour up the Alp is getting closer and closer. But that's corner six. In. I've got the wrong gear. I'm very tired. I'm making mistakes. An average 200 watts. I don't know why I did that then. That's just destroyed me. That's corner five. Yeah, doing really well. I mean, I averaged 185 watts there. No? Yeah, 185. Okay, corner four. I've got 900 meters to the next corner. This is the longest corner to the top. The rest are like four, three, four hundred. I've only got three corners left. I've got no 90 day PR, which means my last attempt, obviously, was over three months ago. Even though my video on YouTube says two months. <sighs> Corner three, corner three, there we go, 201 watts. Okay, two short corners now. Okay, two short corners, come on. Two, corner two. Grinding. Corner two, come on, just over a K. The end. Very nearly sub 80. 600 meters. Oh, gears all wrong. Oh my. Just let, let my weight drop. Eighty-five, thirty-five, sub ninety minutes, sub ninety minutes. Ah, under an hour and a half. Eighty-five, thirty-five, an hour and twenty-five minutes. Ah, smashed it. Right, I'm going to try and get off this bike, and I'm going to lie on the shelf floor. Ah, yeah, yeah. I'm over the moon with that. If I'd had something to eat, that would have been a sub 80. Anyway, I'm over the moon with that result. Oh, 
Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. I've just achieved a new one minute, a new five minute result off that. So that I've got a new one minute of 423 watts and I have a new five minute of 294 watts. My 20 minutes was 237. I'm over the moon with that. <laughs>